because the cops are making us go through this area either way. So, check this out, check this out. And that is the reason why this area here supposedly is illegal. to the Miami Bro channel. We're having a uh, family day out on the boat. We haven't came out in a while with the boys and uh, we decided to take them out uh, to uh, Sandbar. And uh, what other better place than to go to than the all over Sandbar. They've never been there. We've never actually taken this long trip over there with them. Uh, supposedly today it said it was gonna be you know, a pretty decent day. It wasn't gonna be windy. Uh, it wasn't gonna be choppy. Um, so, uh, the app that I use sometimes is wrong <laughs> because the area leaving from Madison Hammock all the way up to the point where you get to this area which is the downtown area here it, it does get choppy then uh, once we pass uh, a couple of other bridges um, which is basically the uh, I'm not so sure what street that is what, what street is that? that, that bridge? what street is that? that's uh, I-95 right? Uh, yeah, I think, yeah that's I-95 uh, huh? No. Uh, whatever. I'll find out what street that is, what bridge that is. But I think it's the three. I think that's three ninety five. Yeah, yeah. That's it's, it's three ninety five. Uh, once we pass that bridge, that's typically when the water gets better. But uh, check it out. government's cut you guys have seen my uh other video if you haven't go back and check it out it's one of my videos i recorded about government's cut which is another way to get to the other side of the ocean on the east side and here we have the hard rock that's located here in Bayside. that is downtown right there downtown brickle i'll say better Look at this. So apparently, oh, yeah, you have to go really slow here because they're doing they're doing work there. Yeah, yeah I mean, I, I mean, I don't pull the seat. I out. That's what they're doing. But look, they're expanding here the, the, the cruise boat place. Uh -huh. And it seems like they're digging holes here. So that the cruise boat, when they pass by here, they have enough space, I guess, uh, to back up and do whatever they gotta do. Look how they dig out. Oh yeah, yeah. Look, 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 look how they're pulling out the thing. All right, that's how they put in the the post. They're they're digging in the hole. Yeah, cool. All right, guys, check it out. No, no, Jacob. No, no. Jacob, come to the sombra. All right. No, 
I'm gonna go straight. No, they're not letting no. That's why they're there. They're not letting nobody pass to, to over there. That's why he, he's, he's looking at this guy over there. They're not allowed to go over. There. Yeah, look, he just turned on his lights. I don't think they're allowed to go over, baby. No. It's been known that supposedly when the cruise boats are there, you're not allowed to go with your boat there. Alright guys, so we made it here to Hallover Sandbar. Check it out. <laughs> so it's the first time I was bringing the boys out to this sandbar. Uh, and uh, hopefully we'll have a good time. We'll find a good spot. This place looks like it's pretty packed. So, let's see, let's see, let's see what's going on. Hey guys, how you guys like this spot? How you, how you guys like this spot? Yeah, uh. <laughs> it was a far trip, huh? Guys, it was a far trip, huh? Yeah. But, check it out. Um, um. But totally worth it. <coughs> but, totally, totally worth it. Watch out the rope, guys. I told you, watch out with the rope. <laughs> you didn't see the rope? No, no. Okay, well, you gotta look down when you're walking, bro. See how nice this is? Oh, the Hallover Sandbar. Do you see, guys? How this is? So apparently, this is where they're going to be. Uh, Digging out all this sand, removing it from here. Apparently, it seems, uh, I think I've heard that they already started some time ago. But uh, it's a lot of sand, man. This is gonna take forever. I mean, I really hope that they don't do that. Because this is this is amazing. This is an amazing spot to come to hang out with the family. So, how you guys like this? It's the first time you guys have been here. How you like this? Yeah. Huh? This is not for me, I'm good for a five out of five. What? What'd you say? I'm good for a five out of five. A five out of five? <laughs> what about you? 102. 102 out of 5. Wow, buddy. You guys really like this spot. Look at the little fishes. Oh my god, this guy's like totally hitting this guy's boat and they're not even moving. They're like, oh, it's all good. You hit the, the, the front of the boat. <laughs> oh my god. The guy, the guy didn't even have the, the propeller inside of the water. Look, it's still spinning outside. Oof. And this guy, this guy, this guy got completely sanded. Look at the boat completely outside of the water. Oh my God. All right, so you know this guy right there? <laughs> He's gonna wait until high tide. And guys, like always, if you're hungry, there's a little uh, boat food truck thing with jig. <laughs> I don't know what else to call it. A food uh, boat chilling here where you can go over there and uh, order food and do whatever you want. All right, so wait, hold on a second. So my son apparently caught a little crab here. Oh no, that's just to decorate. Wait, so wait, Ethan, so wait, you say you have a little crab in there? Yeah. <laughs> oh, okay. So as you guys 
you guys can see this is a very family oriented place besides being a party place uh, very chill very nice that's our bag okay. well this guy here definitely is waiting for high tide <laughs> So it's the end of the day for us. Uh, I'm gonna say uh, thank you for watching the Miami Bro channel. We were out here having a great time with the family, with the boys. This is their first. This is their first time out here at Hall Over, and we actually caught some of these. We caught four of these things, four of these suckers. There's uh, snails, or I don't know the name of them exactly, but they uh, they're inside. They're inside of the shell. What, what, what are these called, babe? I have Spanish Macao, but in English, uh, it's a snail. That's, that's a turtle, bro. Mira. Mira, look, look, guys. That is a snail, right? That goes sea snail that goes into one shell, and once it outgrows that shell, it goes into the other shell. <laughs> All right, guys. So, if you know what that is, comment down below and let me know uh, what's the name of this thing. I think it's a snail, sea snail. I don't know. Whatever. And um, thanks for watching the Miami Bro Channel. <laughs> oh, hey, that is the pet. That that is that is Gary, the pet of SpongeBob. That's what that is. That is Gary. That is Gary. That's the pair of SpongeBob SquarePants. That's what I know. <laughs> it is. And SpongeBob's pet is in his Gary. <laughs> so that is Gary. I caught four Garys today. All right, guys. Um, stay tuned for the next video. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe. I appreciate all of your uh, comments. I try to always respond back to you guys. And uh, I'll catch you in the next uh, in the next adventure.